This is Riverwatch for January 21st, 2022. Pennsylvania environmental officials say several hundred fish, including native brown trout, were killed in a stretch of the Valley Creek in East Whiteland Township last week. The Pennsylvania Fish and Boat Commission says gravel that drained into a tributary of the stream from a water main break is the suspected cause, but that the investigation into the fish kill is ongoing. Anglers who fish in the Valley Creek say the stream has been harmed by a number of isolated incidents. It's one of the few streams in southeastern Pennsylvania that holds wild fish, uh, wild brown trout. So all the fish that were here that were killed were, uh, were born in the stream. Uh, these were not stock fish. The Valley Creek is a tributary of the Schuylkill River. A February 1st court hearing is scheduled in a lawsuit trying to stop apartments and other developments from being built at a waterfront park in Morrisville. A grassroots group says the town would lose a recreational area and that the development would be placed in a floodplain. Once a park has been donated and dedicated as a park, it belongs to the public and it needs to stay a park. There's some encouraging news regarding the striped bass population in the Delaware River estuary. Spring sampling conducted by Pennsylvania Fish and Boat Commission biologists found the 11th highest catch rate on record and the catch rate of striped bass over 28 inches was the 10th highest ever recorded. In 2020, new size limits and circle hook regulations were put in place to reduce the mortality of the fish in the river.